Yo guys, Cal here, back with another video. It is 9.49 at night. I'm going to be showing you how to make coins on NHL 23. I have 74k. I started at zero when I was doing this. I opened packs in my videos and I got to zero coins. Um, and now I'm at 74k from just doing this method. So yeah, I'm going to show you what I've been doing. It's been working pretty well. I'm sure people already know about this, but I'm just going to try to explain it the best I can. Um, and yeah, it, ha it has to do with the market. Um, so in my trade pal, I already have three cards. I have 79s. So you can do this with any cards, really. I recommend gold cards. Um, we're not going to use those as, as an example, though, because they're already in the trade pal. But those are cards that I have gotten. Um, so basically, you want to go to overall. And you, like I said, you can do any overall from like... 81 or even like 78 to like 81 um but yeah i usually do 84 to 85 um and then you you look at what they're going for and like one 9k um 10k that's pretty cheap um some are expensive some are cheap 11k um and yeah, so 9K is like, oh, that one's for 8K. That could be a steal. Um, but yeah, so that's roughly the price. You look at the price of them, and then you go to buy now, um, minimum. We'll just go 2,000 because there's no way buying one for 2,000. And I usually start 5K, and then we work our way up. Um, and what you do is you just keep spamming search and you just keep raising the price as you go along and eventually if you get lucky you know you could get a steal card could pop up and you could um you could um uh flip it and make coins and it's not going to it's not going to um be the fastest method of making coins because you list the, the shortest time you can list it for in the market is an hour so you do have to wait an hour but if you have a, a starting point like me I'm at 74k if you have a starting point to do it then you can definitely do it faster than you would if you would have like 20k um and yeah I want to try and find at least one decent snipe um I have ha I have gone 84s for 2k or not 2k i've gone 84s for under 7k so it is possible um but like i said at the beginning of the video right now it's 952 and it is still early it's still early access not early access but it's still the i got the uh, pre-order so i got it like four days early so i don't know if everyone has it yet but if you don't watch the video and this is a way of making not free coins but a coin making method you know um and yeah if you guys are new make sure to drop a like subscribe um we're working our way to 400 that's the goal uh for the channel right now we're up to 7k i feel like we're for sure gonna get one in between 7k and 8k it's bound to happen um but yeah you, you don't want to give up either that's the thing you just got to keep going up in price and you never know what you'll find if you find one low you get lucky and you, it's a steal um even if you find one for like eight nine k you're still making at least 500 600 700 coins profit and cards you might want to hold on to them as well if you can snipe them and then just hold on to them because you never know they could go up in price as well for like sets or you know anything like that and then if you got it cheap you can flip it and make coins um and I'll show you too as well as my sold items of who I've been doing. I've been doing 84s and 85s and yeah. But so far, nothing. 7, 8. And you really do want to put some time in this as well. It's not just going to be like a five minute thing and you're done with it, you know. Like I was, I spent maybe two hours earlier doing it and I got uh, 74k. And you can only list 25 things on the market so at once so i got 75k in two hours so three hours realistically i could probably get over 100k so 
just from flipping. But like I said, you have to be at a good solid coin balance um, to actually buy and flip and then keep buying and keep flipping. But if you start off with like, you know, 500 to 1,000 coins, just do your do your sets, your rerolls, do your challenges, do your, um, what's it called? In the main menu. I forget. But yeah. Come on. I really want to get a snipe for the video, but it's not looking like it. Because I, I was getting, like, before earlier, it was like 2.30 in the afternoon. I was getting a bunch for like 8.1, 8.2. A bunch of like 84s, 85s. I got a Soros for like 7k and it was, I flipped them for like 9. So I was like 2k profit and now I'm not getting nothing. Maybe like it's all about time I guess, but I don't know. We're up to 8.5 now. Before we saw some players going for 9,000. So even so 9,000, that's still a 300 coin profit. But depending who it is. And like I said, you can do this with any rating, any overall, it works. It really does work. Just, I, I think I'm doing this at the wrong time. So, that's probably why there's nothing. 8.8. .8. Come on. Come on. No. But like I said, it does take time. You do have to kind of have patience to do this. Um... You know, but yeah, that's pretty much the method. That's what I've been doing. That's how I got up to 75k easily. Well, not easily, but just you know, by grinding. We're at 9k now. Do cart? Do prices go up at night? Like, what's going on here? Oops. Come on, someone's gotta have 9-1. How is not how is one not came up yet? But yeah, guys, that's pretty much what you do. You kind of get the gist of it. Um, I really want to get a card here for the video, but it's not looking like there is one because I still have to show my trade pile. Oh, here we go. Nine two. Not bad. Buy now. And send them to trade pile, and I'll show you because I guarantee you we made at least at least. A couple hundred coins and it'll be worth it because if you keep doing it it'll add up it is a goalie so her price may not be the best but yeah so yeah and also another trick that you can do is um some of them are going for like 15 right but some of them are also going for nine so we didn't quite make profit right but then i'm i have the coins so i'm just gonna buy the two for nine send the trade pile Buy the other one, 9-3. Send the trade pile. And now, 10K. I, I list it for 10K. That's, I think, at least 400 on each card. 400 profits. That's 1,200, 1200 coins that we made. And now I'm going to show you my sold items. Um, like I said, a bunch of 84s. Um, Sorrow sold for 8.5. We got him for like 7. That was 1.5k. Sorrow did not sell. Bauer we got cheap. Bauer we got maybe 5. I want to say like 5.9. So that was like a solid uh, math. Math. Like 650. Anderson sold 5k. That one we kind of just broke even. Um, this, this icon, we, we sniped both of them really cheap. 7 1, I think, for one, and then the other one was like 7 2. Um, 8k Hellebuck went for 10, we sniped him for 8, so that was a solid 2k profit. But it's just small profits make a big difference, and it does really change, it just takes time. And yeah, so guys, that's the end of the video. Make sure to drop a like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.